Mayor Gene Stothert says the bid from First Star Fiber would put unneeded stress on the already tight city budget. But this recycling company is the only option in town, a company the city has used since the 90s. Stothert says this bid is so unacceptable, quote, we will reevaluate way alternatives and come up with a solution, which could include rebidding the contract with different terms. I think we're all a bit surprised by the amount, so I would support, you know, analyzing that bid some more. Councilman Pete Festerson is an environment advocate and agrees $4 million is a lot, but says recycling should be a top priority. The city needs to remain committed to recycling program. That's a very important thing that citizens expect. It's the right thing to do. I'm certainly not going to rubber stamp $4 million. Councilwoman Amy Melton agrees the city can't afford this bid and was expecting half that amount after the involved trash negotiations earlier this year. I understand it's the only bid we got. Recycling is absolutely a priority to me, but you can't say uh, we're going to do it at any cost. The mayor says we have already committed to picking up recyclables for the next 10 to 20 years in our new contract with FCC Environmental. It begins in 2021, and the city says it can budget that cost without a tax increase. There's got to be another way, and I think maybe we need to take a step back to figure out what that will be. Well, both Festerson and Melton say there needs to be more discussion about that $4 million bid and what the mayor's office is looking at for alternatives. Now, we left messages for First Star Fiber this afternoon and have not heard back yet. Back to you, David.